Christian oh, Lanshaw. He came in his humanity. Listen, he was fully believe, God or not? Do you believe that he came as a servant? He was always a servant. Yes, he came as a servant. Yes, and he came in his human form. So he did not reveal himself in that way. Okay, well, be careful, so, you know. Can I make a statement now? I bought some stuff for the kids. You said. So you said he came as a human being. Yes. You said he came as a servant, and he came as a human being. I'd rather not be filmed. That's why you can film me. You don't. He doesn't have to film because they don't want to. It's a public space, though. They don't want to be caught out on camera. That's what you like to say. Well, why don't you want to be filmed? It's a public space, to be honest. Why you don't want to be filmed? Yes, yes. You don't need to show up. No, 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 no. You're right. You're right. You have a right. Anyway, absolutely. I agree with that. Well, you're not exactly. Yeah. How really? Many things. Because anyone, anyone who dies. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Napoleon has claimed God. Pharaoh claimed that he was God. Let me make the point. Let me make the point you made. You said he came as a servant, and then he was a human being. Do you stick to only that definition of Jesus, or do you also add that he's fully God? I think he can answer by himself. God, do you believe he's fully God as well? I believe that he was fully God. Yes. Right. But also in his human form, he was also fully human. So when you say fully God, when you say fully God, is he fully knowledgeable, like? Like the Almighty God. Muhammad. Okay. In certain ways, he did limit his knowledge. He's not fully God. He cannot be logical. He cannot be logical. If he's fully God, then he should have the full attributes of God. What is the meaning of calling someone fully God if he don't have the full attributes of God? You don't understand how he is. He doesn't want to be filmed. He said that. Okay, I'll stand in front of you. That's fine. That's fine. If you don't want to be filmed, that's fine. As long as you can get the audio. You can film him. So, so, so basically, if you're going to be filmed, so you see, if you want to have a Talk. Yes. You can talk and we can go to the rails. I'll record. Hello? I'm recording you. Go and carry on. Okay, no. That's your problem. I don't mind telling you what Adam to you. Adam, we love the Lord Jesus Christ. But what? But you don't want to be filmed? Why? I, I, I don't want to make a spectacle. It's not a spectacle, it's a discussion. It's, 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 when you come to Speaker's Corner, you see hundreds of cameras here. The reason for that is because we want to educate people just like the way you want to educate people. I'm definitely not recording you. Well, that goes to your close friends. I'm recording from here. Not really. Is this? Not really. Hashim. I've accepted it. I'm recording from here. You can't be standing. He's behind you now. I'm behind him. I can't see him. So he's only going to film me. How about that? Is it okay to stand here, guys? Is that too soft? Respect him. He doesn't like. I'm not respecting. Yeah. First of all, this is a public space. I can record. I know, I know. First of all, first yeah, of all. Yeah, yeah. However, I am. You can do the same on camera. You can do the same on the camera. Well, no, I, I, I don't, we're not here to make a spectacle or to have a camera. Anyone who records you doesn't make a spectacle. Do you think yeah. Bob the Builder became a spectacle? Well, he's able to debate with you. And I'm you're not? not? I, I'm not able to. I, I can explain to you in a quiet atmosphere. I can bring you to the well, Lord. Well, because Con is not I, a quiet atmosphere. I, yeah. You're in the wrong place. No, for a quiet atmosphere. Yeah, well, we're here you're to in learn. the wrong place. We're here to learn. We're here to see. Yeah. Well, if you're here to learn, then let's yeah. learn. Yeah. Come on. Well, you also not, need to learn as well. I'm here. I'm here. Look, he's behind you, so he won't record you. No, no, it's all right. That's all right. Thank you very much. Maybe when Bob comes, he'll speak to you, and then we'll see how. Don't hide there. behind Bob. Well, well, if you are a Christian you, listen, and I'm you know the Bible, then you shouldn't be hiding behind other people. No, we're not, we're, Bob had his chance to explain the Trinity and he failed miserably. He didn't fail. He did. No way did he fail. Okay, way, show me which. Our, show me which was. You have seen the video, right? Show me which was he showed from the Bible that show, proved the Trinity. He asked you which questions which you didn't answer. Really? And he and he could okay, not. Which question did I not answer? Let's see if you remember. I don't remember. Exactly my point. You see what I mean? <laughs> no, if you don't want to be recorded, that's fine. But I'm saying, if you are a Christian and you know your Bible, then you should, you are in a position to have a dialogue or have a debate. There's no problem. There's no need to hide behind people that oh, I don't know how to debate. You don't know how to debate. I, you're perfectly capable of having a conversation. I'm, I'm, I'm happy to have a conversation with you, one to one. I can lead you to the Lord. You can ask me questions and I'll explain them to the best of my ability. But it's not quite as simple in how you speak when you when you twist things around and you put things in a different way and then of course that puts us on the back. We're, we're not, are you able to substantiate we're, we're, that allegation that I twist things? Yeah. Are you, okay, show me one example which I twist things. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if you're a man of your words. You, no. made, an, you made an allegation that I twist things. Yeah. Show me something well, that I right. twisted. God. So, so when, when you say, well, who is God? What is God? And then you're, you're putting it in as three gods. We, that's not what we believe. So that's one, one example. Did I say okay. three gods to you now? 
for you said yeah how does one god uh, does one god uh, worship the it's other god so that was the question that's yeah, I, the question yeah, i asked yeah, you wait a minute exactly, i think exactly. you've even forgotten the question yeah. let me rephrase the question yeah. or repeat the question i asked you if they, if you believe in an almighty god does that god have a god that was the question to you so do not misrepresent my question by saying i told you that you believe yeah, in three and gods did, and we did answer that question okay so what was the answer what wait what was the answer yes yes or no in his in his human form yes he will pray he 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 will worship the god he will talk to god in his human form in his human form is he fully god he didn't suddenly become an atheist right no no in his human form is he fully god in his human form he is god and he is human okay so this god pray to god so there is this huge this is how yeah this is how he came he this is how he revealed himself and in the bible this is how he revealed himself so if you want to pay attention and open your eyes come out from the blindness you can find what he's trying to say there what blindness and what blindness jesus himself says when you say that he's fully god and fully man this fully god and fully man says in john chapter 20 verse 17 which bob the builder didn't want to answer yes go and check up the video again okay. i asked him a specific question yes. Why does you Jesus what, claim let me finish the question let me finish the question should do is I let you yeah. finish the question let me finish the question when Jesus said in John 2017 I go to my father and your father my god remember this he's fully man fully god so this fully man and fully god is saying I go to my god and your god yes. that means the god that he worships this fully god worships It's so the same God as well. It's fully man I, as well. I, I did say that. Forgetting that. I did say that. Yeah. Fully so man, a, fully God. Yeah. I've repeated so many times. He, he didn't become an atheist. I didn't say he became an atheist. Okay. He so, did not become a yeah. god because the god doesn't have a god. Yeah. So he did worship his father. Yes. Right. Because not only father, he's god. Yes. Say he's god. His father and god. Yes. yes. So you believe that this fully man and fully god has a god. This fully man and this fully was worshiping god the father. Now why did you stop at fully man? Go on, say. Fully man and fully god has a god. has it was worshiping his father who is worshiping the, no why the father why not god the son is worshiping the father no the son is worshiping god he says well, i go yeah, to my father he, your father my god and your god yeah. so when jesus yeah. who is fully man and fully god says my god what do you understand by it well do you believe that jesus don't ask me a question yeah, yeah. the question answer the question yeah. Yeah. when jesus says i go to my god yeah. and your god jesus who is fully man and fully god to you yeah. says that i go to my god what do you understand by it Well yes he's worshiping his god he's not an atheist thank he's, you yeah he's worshiping does god worship yeah. a god he's, he's worshiping his father yeah, does god does a fully as god a worship human, a god as a human why did he say only human because in his human form no but why he, do you say only did. human why didn't he say fully god as well well he's fully god and he's fully remember human remember the hypostatic union you brought in it's not about playing words it is not words i'm using the same terminology you guys use yeah. hypostatic union whether you want to call him the second person of the trinity or whatever you term you want to call him yeah. this second person of the trinity clearly says okay. that i go to my god and your god in the bible which is bob the builder to, didn't want to answer the question he said that are you asking he, he, as as he, a hypostasis or as a human being or as what in order, he knew exactly what i mean the reason he evaded this question is because he knew he it is a big question, question to answer. you never you the never, reason you guys are evading this question so you agree that here. so you agree with me that he worshiped a god i don't agree with you because you don't agree with you at all well, agree you with worship, the bible then you haven't used established worship he called him god you haven't established worship does god have a god from the things that are written what when th this is what i'm trying to say to you i use the bible the i didn't bible, twist it you no, no, no. you added the word you, worship you you added you something you added oh wait 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 so if somebody says i believe in a god by default does he worship that god If you acknowledge somebody as God, do you want Jesus didn't know? No, but I'm I can't see anybody with Jesus. Jesus fell father. on his forehead on the ground and what did he do? Where did he where did he, he say he fell on his forehead? <laughs> and he prayed. He didn't say prayer prayer. Prayer. Uh, in Christianity, uh, prayer is necessarily worship. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. In Christianity, in Christianity, in Christianity, do you call anyone other than you worship God? God sorry, sorry. In Christianity, do you call anyone other than Almighty God? 
Anyone other than you worship as God? That's why they don't love the I'm, I'm a bad Christian, so I worship. Sometimes I worship things that aren't God. No, no, I'm not talking about a bad Christian. I'm talking about. I should only worship God. I'm talking about a true Christian. I should only worship God. There's a true Christian who worships. Call anyone other than God Almighty God. Any one of you can answer that question. I can call money God. Sometimes I call. You know, you, you know exactly what I mean. You as a believer who believes in God Almighty and who, who worships God Almighty. Would you, or you, or you call anyone other than God Almighty, God? See, if you're only one God that you worship, you're not going to accept another God. Thank you very much. That's a good question. Now, now Jesus accepted somebody else as God. What do you mean somebody else? Somebody else other than himself. Let him be a curse. You need to understand the incarnation. You don't understand it. No, but do you understand? Because you don't understand. Okay. Is the Father and the Son the same being or the different beings? This is already been answered. This is already been answered to you. You have an answer. You don't answer. Okay. You, you, answer. Okay. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you. I'll tell you what. I will say. You tell me if I if it's wrong. As far as as far as the Athenian Creed and the Nicene Creed, they no no. I'm not. I'm giving exactly what you believe in, but you don't want to no. acknowledge it. The reason, the, the reason you don't understand. You don't want to understand. You don't want to understand. Which part of not understand? You don't want to understand. You, 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 you made it too simple. The Bible explains it all. Too simple. You want to make it too yes. simple. You, you have to make it complex. Yeah. No, it's how the reason God says you, not the author you, of confusion okay, are is for you, this reason are, because you guys make it complex. Okay. You Whereas God has made it easy. God so says there's you, only one God. You guys so say three in one. So you, you, you claim that you know God. Second, you claim you know God. Did I claim that? Don't put words in my mouth. I claim, I claim only what God revealed about Himself. So God says that He's one. Then He's one. If God says that there's no other. God besides him, then there's no other God besides him. I think it's like Yes, of course, you don't. We're not going to get anywhere at all. You don't want to know the truth. They don't want to hear it. You've already said that I'm suspicious of others Christians here, but you don't accept it. You, you won't accept it. I think you, got, you don't want to accept your Bible. That's what I see. The Bible says something, and you guys say something else. No, they're going away now. You go around, right, with respect, you go around and you ask questions.